how do you start math with a child using the Robinson curriculum from the very beginning? In this video, I'm going to talk about how to use an abacus before you move on to math flashcards, before you move on to sex in 5-4. So stay tuned. Hi everybody, my name is Karen. Welcome back to our channel called Our House. And if you're new here, please consider subscribing. If you'd like to go from questions to confidence when it comes to the Robinson curriculum, I'm here to answer questions. And a question that I see pop up often is parents wondering, do they just get the flashcards in the very beginning? I mean, do they even understand what they're doing conceptually? Do they understand what this means? And so I'm going to show you how I go about it, how I approach it from the very beginning using a simple tool like this, an abacus, to then going to flashcards to then starting 5-4. And this is actually a little sample of a course that I'm working on, on how to start the Robinson curriculum with children from the very beginning. If this is all that you're using, the Robinson curriculum, which I highly recommend, how you can do it from the very beginning with your small children. So let's talk about the math component of it. And so what I do is with the abacus, first we just start counting, just one to 10. Then we go from one to 100, making sure that they can count really strong from one to 100. After that, we move on to counting by tens and then counting by fives and then counting by twos. Okay, so you work through all of that, right? Then I work on number recognition. So I might have two numbers on a piece of paper, 24 and 42. And I should preface this too that while they're doing this, while they're working on all the counting, I give them the um, RC penmanship pages that have the numbers on them. And so they're working on writing their numbers, right? So they're doing that as they're learning how to count. So now they're solid on skip counting and counting to 100. Well, now I'm going to uh, work on some number recognition. So for example, I'll write down on a piece of paper 24 and 42 and I want them to show me on the abacus how to show me 24 and how to show me 42. If they're not counting correctly or they're getting mixed up, this is where you troubleshoot that. So after we work on number recognition, they've got that down, then we start on the math flashcards. Now the first sections here, I will demonstrate it for them. I will show them how one plus one equals two and two plus one equals three, right? Now the addition and subtraction are mixed up in the first cycle. Um, each stack is always the same operation, but after this stack is subtraction. So then I'll show them, you know, three minus one equals two. Now the RC course of study says that this is fine to use in the beginning so that they realize the concept, they're seeing it, but it shouldn't be used as a crutch. So after a while, you take the abacus away and they're just memorizing. I would say after the first maybe um, two, three little batches, they should be able to then go by rote memory. So yes, after that comes memorizing all the math flashcards. This is the RC set that I love. That's all ready made for you. You can just order it. And the system that I have in place here is my own system and you can purchase it. It has all the little chunks of the flashcards in these little bite-sized chunks, how to organize them. And there's a planner in the back where you can keep track of where they're at. So this is a really handy tool when it comes to the RC math flashcards. And that's it. After they have all this down, they are ready to start Saxon 5-4. So that's how you start a child with math, with the Robinson curriculum from the very beginning, using an abacus and the math flashcards. That's it. I hope this video was helpful to you. If it was, please give it a thumbs up and I will make more videos like this. And if you have any feedback for me on what you'd like to see on a course for RC for Littles, let me know in the comments below so I can make sure to include it. I really want it to be a help and a blessing to families. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in another video. Bye.